two, one, take it, sure. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. This is George Smutnam from New York, bringing you the latest recent vampire activities in Los Angeles, California. That's right, ladies and gentlemen, I said vampire activities. Sounds strange? In this reporter's opinion, it's very strange. However, we have film clips and on-the-spot interviews from our reporter in the field, Sandra Van Oker. But first, these commercial words. Apparently, the old legend about vampirism in Transylvania has some merit and validity. For the last four months, our cameraman has been compiling film clips of actual, I said actual, vampire activities in the city of Los Angeles. And in this reporter's opinion, at very personal great risk. You will see these film clips in a moment. But first, these commercial words. And now, ladies and gentlemen, we take you to Sandra Van Oker at Playboy After Dark in Los Angeles, California. Thank you, George. I've managed to call her Rodney Alucard III, who it is reported to be a direct descendant of Count Dracula the Vampire. Rodney, dear. Rodney. Rodney, would you tell me, is there any merit to the fact that because when your name is spelled backwards, it comes out Dracula. Does that lend any credibility to the allegations that you are in fact a vampire and therefore the direct descendant of Count Dracula? Sandra. And may I call you Sandra? Legend. Fairy tales in the neighborhood mean nothing. When people are in the neighborhood, they talk a lot about people who are no longer... Thank you, alive. Rodney. And now, George, back to you. Thank you, Sandra. And now, these film clips taken by our cameraman in the field. Please watch the monitor. Back in one minute, ladies and gentlemen. But first, these very important commercial words. Again, ladies and gentlemen, we take you to our reporter at large and a real live interview with the female vampire, Mona Lisa. Sandra? Thank you, George. I've been having a delightful talk with Mona here, and she's been telling me of some of her experiences as a, a real live vampire. Uh, actually, uh, stop it, Mona. Actually, uh, she said that she danced in... Uh, uh, Muna, Muna, if you please, be quiet. She said she danced in a nightclub and lost... Uh, Muna, Muna, stop it. it uh, uh, and she said... She... Uh, and she said that she danced in a uh, play... Uh, yeah, uh, uh, now, George, back to you. Jesus Christ, I got in this suit just to get away from you, cunt. George, what do I do now? Ladies and gentlemen, we seem to have lost contact with our reporter at large. Oh, but wait. Ladies and gentlemen, these film clips have just arrived from our hidden cameraman. Ladies and gentlemen, watch the monitor, please. George, I've been sitting here talking with... Rodney and Muna about the life of the Los Angelino vampire. Uh, we're here in the game room, George. It's a marvelous game room. They have a pool table. Uh, there are several heirlooms about the place from Transylvania. There. <laughs> That's all, George. Back to you. That's it, ladies and gentlemen, from George Smutnam in New York. And remember. You were there. And now stay tuned for the late movie, The Mad Motorcycle Monster Who Ate Naked Hippies. Thank you, and good night.